Hi dear student, how are you? I hope you're fine. Today we're gonna have part one of the psychological uh, revision of quarter one. I have here some questions and we discussed this before. In an experiment, the group not exposed to the treatment are called what? What group? Control group or experimental group? Not exposed control group, right? Instead of following set of individuals over a number of years, over a number of years, in this is longitudinal, researchers select sample that includes people of the different ages. This one is the cross-sectional method because the longitudinal was very expensive and it was very hard to follow people. Uh, observing behavior in laboratory rather than in field is called what? Of course, laboratory observation comes from its name. Individuals selected by chance from a target population. We know that target population, people I make research on, selected randomly, so this is what, or by chance, random sample. Factors researchers manipulate so they can determine its effect here, the independent, and this is uh, the matching. A set of controlled observation that test the hypothesis. So when I have a hypothesis, this is a uh, becomes after this some observations controlled observations to test my hypothesis is correct or not so this is called what the experiment that i do factor that can change in an experiment this is called variable standards for proper and responsible behavior of course what we have the ethics and we have ethics in the psychology yes gathering information by asking people people sorry directly is what a survey asking people orally directly or filling out questionnaires substance or treatment has no effect apart from a person's belief in it no effect illusion like this it's what it's the placebo you remember the drug a variable whose value depends on that of another variable depends on another dependent variable experiment uses control groups as well as experimental groups this experiment is called what controlled experiment this experiment is called controlled experiment people agree or consent to participate in a research study only after they have been given a general overview of the research and have been given the choice of whether or not to, art to participate they are called informed consent in-depth investigation or of an individual individual or just small group of course the case study part of the target population but i didn't mention this is a random one or not so it's called sample right or wrong true or false i have here um field study naturalistic uh, observation of course here the field study must be a naturalistic observation as one variable increases the other decreases this is what this is the yep this is the negative correlation as here one variable increase the other decrease in an experiment the group that's exposed really to the treatment is called what control that is exposed to the treatment here the question is it called here um, control group no of course not they are called what experimental group so they are called what experimental group okay people who want to uh, volunteer to participate in research studies offer differ from people who do not this is called what this is not uh, informed concept no this is the volunteer bias researchers select a group of participants and then observe those participants over a period of time longitudinal um, part of target population this is the sample we said okay we said all of this Thank you for listening and uh, we will uh, discuss the rest in part two. Bye bye.